love miss hello my beautiful friends merry christmas i am so excited that you guys stayed with me for this vlogmas journey thank you for supporting me and loving me i love you guys so much and i'm so 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 grateful for you i hope that your christmas or holidays are filled with warmth and love and you feel appreciated and celebrated and if that's not the case as it is for a lot of people this year who are quite lonely or are separated due to the panini and things like that. Sending you love, sending you so much warmth. I celebrate you, I love you, and I hope you guys have an amazing holidays. Good morning. I woke up to my dog crying. It's time to eat, it's like 6 a.m. Yuri's asking for food. But my car is covered in snow and I ran out of food, so I gotta brush off my car, Canadian style, and I thought I would include you guys. But, winter wonderland, my <laughs> car. <laughs> home man I haven't driven in the snow in like a year I'm just gonna go slow I have all seasons on my car not winter tires but it's fine on roads like this Yuri's eating her food my mom brought me over an outfit last yesterday so I have clothes to wear I would say 99% of my clothes are on my parents right now because when I went to Burning Man I just brought my Burning Man stuff and then I lived off my Burning Man stuff and buying vintage for four months. So I'm so excited to have my clothes again. Woo! I ended up getting Yuri a kangaroo blend. Um, I've bought kangaroo for her before. I know that like might hurt some people's feelings, but um, kangaroo is actually a really nutritious meat. And they're good for cats and dogs. So I wonder if Peter will like them. <laughs> You got food on your face. You got food on my face. Love you. <laughs> I made some yerba mate ginger tea this morning. Our quote is, the difference between a flower and a weed is a judgment. That's real. I learned a lot in the last few years about dandelions and how good they are for you. Like you can eat every single part of them. You can make a tea that's a coffee replacement. It's good for your heart. It's good with minerals. Yet we spray them every single year. So now every time I see dandelions, I go, I'm sorry for what we've done to you. <laughs> um, anyways, I've got my journal and my iPad here. Um, I've actually started journaling on Notion and that's worked really well for me. I got a life coach. So I have my therapist and I have a life coach now. Uh, her name's Meredith Baker. I was introduced to her through a guy that I met at Burning Man this year and it's his girlfriend. So I'm like, hey, I would love to support people of the tribe and also uh, just like see what comes out of it. I've never had a life coach before. I kind of consider myself a life coach because I'm 100% a life coach for a lot of the people in my life. So it's gonna be interesting to now have someone that life coaches me and I'm gonna share what I learn with you guys as I go. So win, win, win. Win, 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 win. But one of her things is that she's gonna get me to journal on and share it with her. Like there's like an Excel doc, I think for the first few weeks. I've got my paper journal. I'm gonna put this on pause. Uh, I normally journal every day and we're gonna switch. I'm gonna do it in Notion with her format and then so I have my own record and then I'm gonna post it in the Excel doc. So that's my plan for today. While we wait for my tea to cool down. Look at this cute little box cup. Yay, it's the little things in life and to start our morning, since I don't have Luke to talk about this with, every morning as I'm coming out of that dream state and I'm in the liminal state, I like to start my day in appreciation. It is just 100% the highest energy to get your day moving in the right direction. 
Um, so let's think of three things we appreciate. If you want to comment them down below, you're very brave and I love you. Please do that. But my three things that I appreciate today are cute mugs. Waking up next to Yuri. Like even though she's, I'm already jet lagged, but like she's waking me up at like 5 a.m. and I made her sleep until 6. But I appreciate like having her around. Like she's just such a sweet energy. And now combined with this PETA energy, like PETA has been so sweet and cuddly with me lately. I'm just like, I'm in bliss. You know, I just need a horse in my life, which I'm manifesting this year. I'm going to buy a white horse this year or at least start horseback riding again. And I appreciate being in my home. You know, like I, I bought this, <laughs> this is my house. And there's just something really cool like when you move through a home and, and the way you take care of it. Like I take great care of everywhere that I live but like I just noticed the little details that I put into the kitchen and the way I organized the kitchen. I did a big reno and in the bathroom the little details like I put in the shower. I picked out the bath that like fits me perfectly. And it's just all these little things that I'm just like, thank you, past Kristen. This is really sweet. I love this home so much. And I just keep doing little upgrades to it. Yeah, it's just a really sweet home and I really appreciate it. So let me know what you guys appreciate down below. Also, we're still doing the $100 a week um, and then I'm gonna be rolling from the last week for $500. Because I'm gonna do this till the end of December. Oh, and if you've forgotten how to enter, go comment on every single Vlogmas video. We're rolling each week from the group of people that comment on every video. Okay. All right, I got so much work done. I'm working on renewing my O-1 visa, which is what allows me to be in the United States. So I finally, like, oh my gosh, I am so aligned with the TikToks where people are like, after three months, <laughs> I finally completed the three minute task. <laughs> and like, I feel so good about it. Like. Yeah, I have been putting this off for so long, but it's amazing like when my butt kicks into gear, like I think my subconscious just knows exactly the last minute where I have to start getting things done or else. So, yep, got a ton of paperwork done. Even got some of my taxes and finances done, guys. If you're waiting on it, okay, just do it. Just do it, just do it. This is a reminder, just do it. This is more of a reminder for me, just do it. Just do it. Um, yeah, took the garbage out. I've let PETA chill this morning. We're gonna go and cuddle with him for a little bit and then I gotta go and pick up my mentor. We're going for coffee. Only I don't drink coffee, so matcha. <laughs> okay, this is PETA's room. Let's see what mess he made last night. He squished this. He's pulled that off there. He loves using, he, he gets under this and then eats his food <laughs> so nobody can see him. It's so cute. But I think I know exactly where he is. Oh, good morning. Did you have fun last night? Did you have fun last night? Were you playing and exploring your little room? Oh, you're so warm. You've been in there for a while. How's my baby doing? Can't wait till you and Yuri are cuddle buddies. Yuri also likes sleeping. You guys are gonna get along really well. There's my baby. Good morning. Good morning. Like, seriously, he's just warmed up to me so much. So my baby, you waking up? I need to take him to the vet. His eyes have been a little bit runny lately. And he's had to miss two days of his medication because my bags still aren't here. But we're going to take his new blood results to see how he's doing with FIP. And hopefully he's doing good. I mean, he's just like a totally normal cat now. Oh, that was a cute stretch. Who's that? Here. Oh, I need to get his mouth looked at too. Do you hear that sound? He started making it yesterday. Is that one of his teeth? Are they broken? Okay. So you're coming. You're going to the vet. Are you ready to go to the vet? You like this camera? Did you like it? You sit next to the camera. Guys, he loves ya. He loves ya. 
So my favorite thing he does. You wanna get that? I'll get it. I'll get it for you. Um, my favorite thing he does is when you rub his butt, he then rolls onto his belly. <laughs> but let he lets you get have really awesome little belly rubs. Can I get your butt? Can I get your butt? <laughs> He's so cute. Oh my god. I love you, Peter. I love you. We're gonna have a good day. Yeah, what happened to your mouth? What's going on in there, man? What's going on? Can you show me? Anyone, is anyone a cat expert? Can you tell me what that sound is? Me and my buddy. You like to look at the camera, huh? Who's that? He, he like doesn't mind if you rub his belly. It's so cute. Who's that? <laughs> Here, they're your friends. They love you. Can you feel the love tonight? <laughs> yeah. Wow, you're just made for the camera, huh? He's a camera boy. He's a model boy. Goodbye, Yuri. See you later. My meeting with my mentor, or hangout, it wasn't really a meeting, went so good. I told her about my idea. Can't wait to share it with you guys that I want to build. She was so impressed by it and really wants to talk about it more. Now I'm meeting my mom at the Salt Cave Wellness Center. For her birthday, we're gonna do a meditation. Room and pillar, Salt Cave and Wellness Spot. Cool. Happy birthday, Mom! Thank you, Kristen. I just finished in the salt cave with my mom. That was so cool. I've been in a few salt caves actually at different spas and things like that, but this is the first one in Kelowna. They just built it. It was so nice. Did a nice 45 minute meditation with some breath work at the end. I got Lucy to bring me a new outfit because my bags only just got here and look at these are the pants she gives me <laughs> It's cold <laughs> Bim bim baps for the girls. Beep, 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 boo boo <laughs> for Brenda. Lucy. Oh. Okay guys. Here's my stuff. We got buy boost. We got throw blankets, pillows, shoes, a Prada bag, <laughs> yoga mats. All my clothes are somewhere in here. Essential oils, humidifiers, lamps. Ugh. It's a lot. <laughs> I don't feel like going through it all right now. I think I'm just gonna start by organizing winter and summer stuff. And for all of you asking about the Burning Man vlog, it is on this laptop that has been hidden in my car and then hidden at my parents' house for a year and a half. So Burning Man vlog coming out soon. Luke, are you enjoying going through all my memories from the past eight years of streaming? Absolutely. I think we she was a contractor. Some nails. She used to she used to be out there pounding, <laughs> pounding nails. Luke, what do you think of that trophy? It's pretty cool. Yeah, I won that with a Heroes of the Storm tournament. I won. And T Pain handed that to me. T Pain? T Pain. <laughs>
I mean, it's, it's a memory worth keeping. <laughs> what is, uh, what was the game? Heroes of the Storm. I don't know the game. It's a Blizzard Heroes game. The they don't update it anymore. Okay. All right, this is my room now. I also found a colored light. But everything is organized into piles. I've got a giveaway pile. I don't know if you guys are interested. Like, I have an old laptop and an old PC and some old headsets, like HyperX stuff, and old cords, like, I don't and old mice. I don't really know what to do with this stuff. <laughs> and check out this fit I found. This is from the TwitchCon Intel event. It's HP. I won it. That's where that trophy was from. Oh, yeah. What do I do with this? Is it time to show them your trick? So I probably should teach her more tricks. If you have a good trick that you think I should teach her, let me know down below. <laughs> Had a nice evening, went and saw my family. It was great. Luke and I got my bags. We picked them up from the airport. Apparently the other two bags had arrived. PETA misses pet meds for three days. So we're going to a 12 hour schedule now, hopefully because his eyes were looking a little red. He wasn't looking very good. So lots going on here. Uh, what else? Oh, it feels good to get my bags. I got some toys for PETA and I cleaned my entire room. You guys saw that. So yeah, I'm pretty exhausted now. It's only 9.30, but I think I'm still a little bit jet lagged. Going to make some tea, cuddle Yuri. Luke is spending some quality time with PETA and have a new day. Ooh. Oh, and I had a call with my life coach today for the first time. It went so well. I just needed an accountability partner and a focuser and we had a great call and she's giving me some homework to do. Maybe I can show you guys some of the things that she's getting me to do and you can do it too so you can get free life coaching <laughs> through me. <laughs> well, it will be personalized, which I really appreciate, but some t not everyone can afford this. So I would love to show you guys some of her awesome tactics and I'll show you her Instagram too if you want to get some yourself. such a love affair with tea and honey and yeah it's just such a nice moment to prepare something for yourself and then while you're enjoying it it's so nice and I love it so try drinking some tea <laughs> another thing I wanted to talk about I went through so much of my old twitch stream stuff today it just showed me like how far I've come and how much has happened but most importantly, it made me realize I have a lot of value to give you guys by reflecting on where I've been. And I talked about this with my uh, life coach today too. Like if I can remember where I was when I was having my spiritual awakening, or if I can remember where I was when I was learning about streaming and building the confidence and things like that. Like there's so much value in going back to the mindset that I have and then reflecting on the difference between the points then and the point now. Being able to describe that to others, not as a path to follow, because I think we all have our own paths and they're very unique and the best thing you can do is listen to your heart, but to structure things in a way that there's the right questions to ask, the right mindsets to begin to cultivate or even know are possible in order to find the most amount of success for you. And by success, I mean life enjoyment, okay? I don't mean like fame or money or, unless those are your desires, you totally deserve to have your desires be created. I really just view it as living your most inspired, connected to who you are, full expression, 
life surrounded by people that you have deep loving connections with and have a lot of fun. I'm not here for very long, so I'm really debating if I want to unpack my suitcase or not. But I've been living out of a suitcase now for so many months, four months, suitcase life. You don't know about that, do you? I love you so much. This is the rest of my room. I renovated and designed this house, built this closet. Luke's moving in too, so it's a little messy. But yeah, it feels good to be in this house. Like I was taking a bath the other day and I, like the bath just fits me perfectly because I went to the store and I sat in baths and I found my favorite one. And it's just like the little things when you build your own place. I'll give you guys a quick tour. It's a little messy because we brought a bunch of stuff from my parents' house, but here's the kitchen, island, living room, or dining room, living room, entryway, the bathroom. Like, yeah, I just love this tub and the little things like having the shower curtain bow out. I think this is called a bow shower and a bow tub. Like, it's got angles. Um, and so you just have so much more room in the shower. I'm like having a shower shelf, it's just, just the little things, okay? Am I getting older? This is a sign that I'm getting older. Hi, Pita. There's cuddling. Hi, Pita. Oh, Yuri came. He's so cute. Look at him. Oh my god, I love him so much. You look like a little old lady in your robe that's concerned what the neighborhood is doing. <laughs> oh my god, it's perfectly balanced on her. Oh my god, this dog, look at this. Ah! <laughs> Stop. Stop. That did not just work out that way, Yuri. <laughs> oh my god. You are so cute. Oh my gosh, it's kind of weird having two pets. I'm like, how do I balance my time and attention between the two of you? We're gonna do some more bonding tomorrow now that Luke's here and can help me. And I'm hoping that they become best friends and then they cuddle. Oh, look at this lady. You guys remember when she was a puppy? Look at her now, she's five. My little gray lady. I love you. Do you know that? I love you so much. I hope that your Christmas or holidays are filled with warmth and love and you feel appreciated and celebrated. See you guys in another video. Bye!